now we will see resonance in the closed pipe closed pipe is just like a shehnai or a bansuri in which we uh, put the vibrations of air in a bansuri one side is closed with our mouth and other side is open so any organ pipe which is open at one end and closed at one end that is what we are studying here this is the closed end so one end is closed one end is open in this what happens where are the reflections answer is the reflections are from this boundary this is a closed chamber this is closed and this is open you remember when we were studying reflection of the waves we discussed that denser medium rarer medium denser medium is equivalent to closed medium and rarer medium is equivalent to open medium where air can vibrate to any extent but in closed medium there are restriction so it is like a denser medium so denser to rarer when the waves are traveling there are certain reflections and due to that reflection the two waves are present there having the same frequency so in a tube inside the tube there are two waves present one is traveling in one direction the other one is traveling in opposite direction after reflection and they are having same frequency there is superposition because of the superposition there is formation of the stationary wave there is resonance and we hear a loud sound that is the sound which is coming from the organ instruments okay so we again listen a combination of many frequencies how these many frequencies are formed and what is the relation between those frequencies that we observe by making these diagrams that how resonance can take place there and how stationary waves are formed in the closed pipes now node is always made at a point where vibrations are not possible where there is no freedom of vibration and that point is here because this is a closed surface there is no freedom of vibration here so there is always a node here and this end of the pipe is open when there is a freedom of motion then we can never have a node at that point always there will be anti node so this point is this location is anti node all the time and this location is node at all the time now we listen to many frequencies and we can do the calculation how the frequencies are made there so the first frequency we listen in a closed pipe at that time this is the formation of stationary wave there one wave other wave and they form a node here and a anti node here if length of the pipe is here then this is having an amplitude of 2a and we listen a loud sound that frequency of the sound we can calculate how first relation with l and lambda here we find this is equal to 1/4 of lambda so in this case l is equal to lambda by 4 so lambda is equal to 4l so frequency frequency for the first loud sound for the first tone is equal to v upon lambda and we write it v upon 4l because we know the formula for frequency that is v upon lambda v is velocity of the sound in the air and l is the length of this pipe now at the same time we listen one more frequency and we can conclude that this can be made if in place of one there are two nodes now here we have to keep a anti node here we have to keep a node so this is the only way there will be two nodes during this type of vibration in closed pipe the length is equal to half and 1/4 that is 3/4 lambda so lambda is equal to 4 upon 3 l so frequency in this case is equal to v upon lambda 4 upon 
3 m compare the two this frequency will be 3 times this frequency is equal to 3 new one this is new one this is 3 new one and in between we don't listen any other frequency now after this there is a formation of three nodes two after two there has to be three so this is another type of vibration which is happening at the same time so this sound also comes to us what is the frequency of this sound this is one lambda this is one fourth lambda so length is equal to five upon four lambda so lambda is equal to 4 upon 5 length. So we have frequency here which is equal to frequency V upon lambda and lambda is 4 L upon 5. And now you find this is equal to 5 of this. So this now you can go yourself L is equal to 7 upon 4. 1 and half and 1 fourth. 7 upon 4 lambda, lambda is equal to 4 upon 7 L, nu 4 is equal to 7 V upon 4 L and this is equal to 7 nu naught. Now you see the basic frequency, we hear it, then we hear 3, then we hear 5 times, then we hear 7 times, all these sounds are coming together. But what we miss, there is no 2 new 1, there is no 4, there is no 7. So the combination of frequencies what we are hearing is 1, 3, 5, 7 harmonic. And what is these number? Odd. So we say odd harmonics. are produced in open pipe, no, closed pipe. In string you have seen, we were listening all the harmonics, new one, two new one, three new one, four new one, five. Here we receive only new one and after that 3, after that 5, after that 7. So in the closed pipe we receive only odd harmonics. And if here if we want to find out what is the nth tone, nth tone, what should we write here? We should write here 2n minus 1 of new one. Okay, if it is first, write here 1, this will be 1, second, write here 2, this will be 3, third, write here 3. So this gives us nth tone. If I ask you what is the fifth tone frequency, you write here 5, that is 9 of the ninth harmonic of the fundamental tone. Ninth harmonic of the fundamental tone. So this is all about closed and we get here only odd harmonics and after that we will study the sound coming from open pipe which is open at both the ends. Thank you.